Hello and uh, welcome to this data engineering. Uh, my name is Anand. Uh, in this uh, session, I will be discussing about this margin for knowledge check that is design principles and pattern for uh, data pipelines. So, yes, this is the KC which I am going to discuss. So, the KC I have loaded in already in the next uh, tab. I will put it in this uh, full screen. I just start this, uh, I mean, knowledge check. The first question on the screen. Which statement describes how data architectures evolved from 1970 to present? Uh, so, this is, uh, I mean, uh, data stores, um, that is evolved to adapt increasing demands of data volume, variety and the velocity. Yes, I can take this. That is correct. Second one, what is the role of Amazon Redshift in uh, the AWS modern data architectures. Yeah, Redshift provides uh, a fully managed non-relational database. Yeah, that supports key value data models. Absolutely, this should be the right answer. I will say submit. I mean, fully managed looks like this is the better one yeah okay the third one which types of data movement should be uh, the modern data architecture support so only inside out you uh, know both inside out and outside yeah uh, in data movement the architecture should also support a movement directly between purpose built and data stores looks like this is the right answer yeah i submit correct the fourth question what is the role of aws glue in aws uh, modern data architecture so that is uh, facilitate data movement and transformational between data stores yeah that's correct the fifth one a data engineering team is building a data pipeline for batch anal analytics. Which resource would provide the most relevant guidance about the best practices? Yeah, you can take this uh, scenario section from the data analytics lens of uh, <coughs> the AWS well architected framework. I submit this. Yeah, it's correct. The sixth one. Which statement accurately describes the design characteristics of ingestion layer in the AWS uh, modern architecture? So, I can select this use, okay, use uh, purpose built services to match the connectivity, data format, data structure, and data velocity requirements of each data source. Yeah, that is correct. Sixth one. Seventh. Which statement accurately describes the design characteristics of the storage layer of AWS modern architecture? So, this should be uh, Amazon S3 used um, objects, Amazon S3 objects in the data lake are organized into different buckets or identified by prefix to represent different states of data. That should be the right answer. Yes correct. The eighth one, the stream processing pipeline example that is presented in the module describe producers as a part of ingestion and producers layer. Which statement describes a pro producer? Yeah, an integration that collects the data from source and loads it into the stream. Uh, that is uh, eighth one. That is correct. So, we have only eight questions and we got all correct, but instead it mentions as, uh, yeah, yeah, 100 percent, 80 points. Your score is 80 points. Thank you, and we will meet in the next uh, module 5 knowledge check. Thank you. Bye.